Mid afternoon, and we meet this young man, visibly intoxicated and high on what we suspected was crystal meth. Hours later, one of our sources is called as the situation deteriorates into violent skirmishes. This young man is threatening everyone, including his parents. Is the devil at work, and the young fellow is in a world of his own. <laughs> I have covered drug abuse cases and interviewed many survivors, but nothing could have prepared me for this. For over a week we tracked this story. The drug victim in this video agrees to talk to us only if we cover his identity. <laughs> His story gives insight into the world of the benighted, forced into this situation by toxic drugs. Not far from here, we meet Gladys, not her real name. She tells us her sister is now mentally challenged and now lives in dungeons with her three-year-old daughter. Akaenda pani ngaenda varume va kumutora vachimushandisa kumita mukazi dzimwe nguva vanongo mutengera kana mudzanga we fojka akaenda kumatombo ikoko vanozvika anzi vanomupa matombo anenge asina kuibva vanhu vorara naye vari kumushandisa zvisiri zvari kupengere kanofamba netsoka anogona kungobva kunokuenda kunotoni netsoka kana kuenda nekuchitungisa netsoka anofamba ane kamwana kake kane 3 years genius mahia is a youth champion advocating for an end to drug and substance abuse Chikuru chinoda kuti chiitwe anofana kuva nemutemo wakaoma mutemo uno bata vari kuita zvema drugs vari kutengesa ma drugs vari kuma drugs kuma youth uno bata uchisunga usingatarise kuti ndiyani resident meetings such as this one in Glenview 3 are giving voice to what has been known for a long time anoka isaita mari achita zvimwe zvinhu zvake zvinoenda mberi wa ukuraya mwana umwe ngati vataura vani vano vaziva vane dzimba idzo zvakati taura tanga ta kuporisa uko totaura takaita zvikutaura izvo zvo it will take everyone to fight this vice that is consuming thousands of youths in Zimbabwe, with government already sounding a strong warning against peddlers. Theophilus Chumazebisi News, Harare.